Another day on the wood, boss. How you gotta look at it? Yeah, man. Maybe for you. How many scots you think made out to Montana check on me, huh? Don't listen to him, Jonas. Che ain't got no worries. This don't pan out. Adam Silver will probably mention him himself. Poster boy for principal. <laughs> That's funny, Onyx. Well, I'd rather be the boy getting posted if it means I'm making a squad. You feel me? What's up, fellas? Hey, Whoa, what's Scotty up? Pitt. What's up, man? Yeah, a lot of history in this locker room, man. Yeah, check this out. Take a look at this. You know, I'm from Arkansas. Youngest of 12. My dad worked in a mill. Nothing special about the way we grew up. Just poor folks. Sure some of you guys can relate to that, right? Yeah. You know, coming out of high school, I was only 6'1". 150 pounds. Wet. I only received one offer. Central Arkansas, and that was to be the team manager. <laughs> but something happened between my freshman and my junior year. I caught inches. Yeah, I was 6'7 and starting to feast on cats. But this ain't no dupe. This Central Arkansas. My coach is going crazy, going broke, calling all over, trying to get scouts just to come check me. But my senior year, a man named Marty Blake. Marty was known as the super scout for the NBA. He's helped out a lot of people like myself, John Stockton, Ben Wallace. He got us each into the Portsmouth invite, which changed our lives. If you want it bad enough, if you're willing to sacrifice, it will find you. I got six of those to prove it. We'll compete with the best college seniors in the country to earn an invite to the draft as their first chance to give scouts an initial uh, impression and play against other prospects in a 5v5 scrimmage. Okay. Hey, turn that down. Oh, this is the truckers thing uh, we saw. Oh, what is this camera? Can I change the camera? I can't change the camera, bro. Oh, come on. I don't know how to play defense like this. What is this? Oh, shoot. This is so weird. Who's this man? Tyree Gavins? He's taking the mid range green. This man, 34, look like Taj Gibson. Alright, we're gonna need to get some assists, too, though. So, we can't just be dunking on people all game. Although, here comes a dunk or layup. Something. Four points. There we go. Please make that. There we go. Six. Points. We got. We gotta get to assist them. That's pass. Gibson or Butler with the finish. Okay. I'm going in. And one. And one. Go, go. Please, mate. What are you doing? All right. <laughs> no, what the heck he's doing? But it works. Let's go. Come on, make that. Nice. We got takeover. Dunk that baby left hand. Let's go. Should I activate it now or should I try to wait and get team takeover again? I don't know. We're gonna we're not gonna activate it right right now. Wrong button. I had Pichal in the corner, bro. That's what I was trying to hit. That's what I meant to do. Dang it. All right. Well, I accidentally activated takeover, so I lost quite a bit of it. Of course, it's gonna go really fast too, since I'm a low overall. This other guy's got takeover too. But I'm just going to try and get one bucket with it. Hopefully we can get a slam. That would be great. Let's see if this Miles guy can make the free throws. I'm going to get that. We're going coast to coast. I don't care who is in the paint. I don't care anything. Just get out of my way. 
There we go. 15 points now. Oh, I got stripped. Right here. Hook shot. Nice. I'm all on that. Give me that rebound. Let's go. Let's go. I see you, Pishal. That's a bucket. Lay up. Come on, Pishal. Lay up is good. Four assists. I'm going to try to get to five. And I'll try to get to like 20 points, too, before uh, this game ends. Dang. All right. Well, 17 points, four assists, and four boards isn't bad. And we won by 15, so. Oh, we got 5,600 my points from this. All right. We got an attribute upgrade already? Nice. Hey, there he is, Elche. You know A.W.? Not personally. But he's heard of me. I remember now. I think you were on that French under-18 team that we wrecked at the World Cup. <laughs> I was, of course. I was 14 at the time. And yeah, yeah, we are in the same draft class. I guess I'm doing require extra seasoning, huh? Experience is an asset. School to taught you that, playboy. Library card is free. My sweat is nuts. Okay, uh, well, you two are gonna be workout partners and roommates. That'll be fun, All right? So come over here and I'm gonna show you what the next 12 weeks of your life is going to be like. Okay. Movie time. Three months, guys. Three months dedicated to the game you live for. Is that too much to ask? No, sir. Yes, no. Sir. Cool. Great. That's what I thought. Okay, let's move on to the schedule. Hey, Dean. How do you do the... Oh, there's the button actually called calendar. Oh, great. So, official combine invites go out the first week of May. If you're both invited, we'll go out to Chicago on the 16th. After that, we'll be arranging some private workouts with interested teams up until draft week. And then, summer league. But for now, for the next three weeks, you guys are going to be in the gym. Your food is gonna be delivered to your apartment. Now, I don't need to tell you how quick perception can turn. You're gonna find the road is real treacherous if you find yourself fighting for a job in Summer League, understand? Okay, now, let's talk social media, all right? I mean, I get it, you're young guys. If you wanna post something, get your trainer to send you some workout footage. I'm sure people would be stunned to find out that dudes who get paid nine figures actually work on their craft. Okay. Any questions for me? Uh, no, no, I'm good. Perfect, perfect. Feel that? That's the anxiety, all right? Use it, let it fuel you. I mean, Jesus, look at me, I'm sweating like a fat kid at a candy shop. Speaking of, I'm gonna get some popsicles. You want some? We have a whole ton. No, I'm good. No, I'm good. All right, well, I'm gonna make a dent. Made a little extra. Thanks. <sighs> Who's your squad? It was the Ornets. But Toom is a mentor. Lily Taj has been playing with teams in my draft range. Milwaukee, Washington, New York. Smart. Get used to the rosters and rotations. Where does he think he will end? <sighs> All over the map right now. Second round or undrafted, unless I put in some serious work. It shouldn't have to be that hard. <laughs> what? Nothing. I thought your teammates was a victim, that's all. I mean, you act like you didn't know what would happen. I didn't really think about it. Well, my father used to say, an educated man is a calculating one. If you don't regret it, own it. Hey, you're a pretty blunt dude. I'm French. Come on, pick a team that could actually use you. All right. This is dope, bro. 
Let's check that out. Oh yeah. <laughs> you ready for this? Oh yeah. <laughs> Gentlemen, Stacy Gibraltar. I'm your trainer for the next couple months. Just because you don't scoff doesn't mean you're enlightened. Fact is, over the next few weeks, you will despise me. And come July, hopefully, we'll be lifelong friends. We'll meet here every morning at six to prepare for the combine. After lunch, you hit the court. Have you received your first week's supply of food and supplements? Yes, ma'am. It's not the army, fellas. Loosen those shoulders. Make sure you follow the instructions exactly as they're written. Otherwise, you'll just be wasting your time in here. Stretch out, boys. Yes, ma'am. All right, all right. She's real. She's real. <laughs> Replenish. Uh, Catch. Oh, man, that was good. How'd they do? They finished, so better than some. Better than some? That's not really the uh, report card I was hoping for. Uh, guys, funny story. Uh, there was actually a kid two years ago who had to change his shorts about halfway through his first workout with Stacey. What? That's foul, man. Yeah, I know. It was gross. Uh, anyway, he didn't really get drafted. I think he's in Uruguay now. Not really sure why I told you that story. What is this, 50? 15. Okay, weird. Okay, A.W., you can chill. And, uh, Che, I need you neat and tidy because we have a meeting in an hour. A meeting with who? Who knows, man. Come see. Come on, Bailey. <laughs> Later, Stacy. Bye, oh, Zach. My back, Stacy. Bon chance. Whew. Hey, you want to tell me what we're doing here? Not particularly. Mav will see you now. Great. You mean with Maverick Carter? Yeah, man. Act natural. Guys, look, unless we're talking real partnership, we're not going to be interested. I won't be able to get LeBron to move off his couch unless it's equity. So thanks. Sorry to keep you guys waiting. Have a seat. That's all good. So look, uh, Mav handles all of LeBron's marketing and off-court opportunities. The community work, the film TV, the Beats deal, and of course, the lifetime contract with Nike. Hey, how do y'all know each other? Z and I go back a ways being in this business, but the thing I appreciate about Z, besides being a great agent, is he really lets his players grow and make their own decisions. See that? 10 out of 10 review. I gotta add that to my Yelp page. So look, Che, look, I like you. Bron does too. But here at Uninterrupted, what we focus on is really giving athletes a voice, really giving them a platform to become more than an athlete. Hey, uh, tell them what you told me on the phone. Look, I know you're focused on the draft, and that's the right thing, because that's most important to you, but we've talked to a couple brands, and they're interested. Are you serious? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. They saw what you did at Bay City, and most importantly, they're interested in your story. But look, before you get excited, you got to realize one thing. These aren't like super rich deals that are going to change your life. And there's nothing wrong with taking these short deals along the way, as long as you don't sacrifice the long money. Yeah, see, look, Jay. Uh, in the grand scheme of things, these guys are putting down loose chains to tie you up for like a couple years. Now, if you flame out, that's the cost of doing business. But if you blow up, they just got Fifth Avenue product for Canal Street prices. And right now you're hot, but along the way, you have to figure out what type of player you think you're going to be. Forget what Z thinks or what I think. What do you think you're going to be? Do you think you're going to be all pro and all star or do you end up overseas? But you really got to focus on getting to that second contract because that becomes life-changing. So, you think about what Mav said? Mm-hmm. Got any wisdom for me, Mr. Super Agent? Well, in my opinion, it never hurts to listen, but I'm not you. I can't tell you what kind of player you'll become. Let's hear him out, then. Okay, I'll set it up. Yo! Che. Carl, what up, bro? What up, man? Appreciate you coming out. Just trying to get this work in. Oh, it's all good, bro. Oh, come cool. uh, Listen, I could give you the whole spiel about Gatorade's lab, tech, products, and history, but let's be real. What have you been drinking at every single camp, at every game, at every part since you could dribble the rock? Gatorade? Exactly, and what's your flavor? Citrus cooler, man. Long live. Exactly. Listen, pretenders can never compete with the original, and that's just facts. 
Hey, bro, that was a pretty slick pitch you got there. Right? And I even have to use the leg mic bit. <sighs> you know what's going on here? Je ne sais absolument rien. Do what? <laughs> Woo! Cheat day, boys. Celebrate. What are you talking about? I'm talking about the fact that both of you just got your official invites to the 2019 NBA Combine. Yes! Yes, you've earned it, Che. Good job. You I wasn't too worried about. I mean, look, you may already know this, but you're being brought up to Chicago for some interviews and measurements. No scrimmages, no testing. No sense in jeopardizing your stock at this point. In fact, just do a few good team workouts, and who knows, you may even move up a few more spots. But, see, I'm not afraid of computing. I know, I know, A.W. Look, it's not about pride, okay? There's just no upside at this point. Rest, you know, show them you're the big dog in a bit. You, on the other hand, Che, just look, put up some decent numbers, do well in the scrimmage, and you never know, right? Like, guys like, uh, Levine, Siakam, I mean, they all flew up the boards after Chicago. This could be your time. I mean that. Speaking of Chicago, enjoy the deep dish, gentlemen. Personally, I'm not a fan, but uh, bon appetit. French. All right. 